If you like Emma Stone, you should definitely watch our picks for her best movies. You ready for the grand finale? Yeah. What? Oh! Oh! We hope you will enjoy the following ranking. Please let us know your favorite in the comments and make sure to subscribe to never miss a good movie again. Number 10. Battle of the Sexes 2017. Man versus woman. Male chauvinist pig versus hairy leg feminist. No offense. You're still a feminist, right? Battle of the Sexes is a 2017 biographical sports film directed by Valerie Ferris and Jonathan Dayton and stars Emma Stone, Steve Carell, Andrea Riseborough, and Elizabeth Shue. The 1973 tennis match between the world's number one female, Billie Jean King, and ex-male champion and serial con artist Bobby Riggs was billed as the Battle of the Sexes and has become one of the most watched television sporting events of all time, reaching 90 million viewers worldwide. Together, Billy and Bobby served a cultural spectacle that continue to resonate today. Keep talking, Bobby. The more nonsense you spell, the worse it's gonna be when you lose. <laughs> well, I'm the ladies number one. I'm the champ. Why would I lose? Because well, dinosaurs can't play tennis. <laughs> Number 9. Easy A 2010. Feels like I gotta love and I know that it's all mine. Okay, okay, right? wait, wait. So are you going to see him again? Easy A is a 2010 teen comedy film directed by Will Gluck and stars Emma Stone, Stanley Tucci, Patricia Clarkson, Amanda Bynes, Penn Badgley, Cam Gigandet, Lisa Kudrow, and Ali Mikalka. After a little white lie about losing her virginity gets out, a clean-cut high school girl sees how her life matches with Hester Prynne's in The Scarlet Letter. Just like that, Olive's unblemished reputation crumbles to dust, as one harmless little fabrication spins out of control, elevating the once invisible girl to the school's most infamous persona. Will Olive ever manage to clear her name? We did it. Yes! Finally! Now you're a super slut like me. I don't think... Letting Peter Hedlund motorboat you behind a bed, bath, and beyond really makes you a super slut. There were a lot of people walking past, okay? Someone could have easily seen. Number 8. Zombieland, Double Tap, 2019. Can't argue that logic. <sighs> I really miss this. Was that sarcasm? A decade after Zombieland became a hit movie and a cult classic, Lead actors Woody Harrelson, Abigail Breslin, Jesse Eisenberg, and Emma Stone are brought back to the screen by director Ruben Flesher. The American comedy film from 2019 shows how these four survivors continue to deal with the many unique types of zombies that have evolved since the first movie, and how they meet new faces like Madison, played by Zoe Deutsch. But above all, they have to face the growing difficulties of their own devious and improvised family. Is this your dad? Slightly older, better looking. No, yeah. You live here? No, Paul Blart. I live in the freezer in Pinkberry. Mm hmm. It keeps the zombies out, though it is awfully chilly. <laughs> Number seven Super Bad 2007. Are you crying? No, I just have something in both my eyes. I don't cry, that's funny. Hey, look, you look, you look like you're right. Superbad is a 2007 American coming-of-age teen comedy film directed by Greg Matala and stars Jonah Hill, Michael Cera, Seth Rogen, Bill Hader, Emma Stone, and Christopher Mintz Plus. Seth, Evan, and Fogel are three teenage guys who desperately wish to get laid. When a girl asks Seth to get the drinks for her party, he sees this as a perfect opportunity. With Fogel's new fake ID, the trio plan out how to get the alcohol, but things won't go smoothly for them. Makes me feel young again. <laughs> oh shit, it's Carrie Hutchins. She had the biggest tits I've ever seen, I think. Yeah, I heard she got breast reduction surgery. What? Making your tits smaller? That's like slapping God across the face for giving you a gorgeous gift. Number six, Crazy Stupid Love, 2011. No, I am sexy. I am R-rated sexy. Okay, I know what happens in the PG-13 version of tonight, all right? I know. Crazy Stupid Love is a 2011 American romantic comedy film directed by Glenn Ficarra and Jean Requois, written by Dan Fogelman and starring Steve Carell, Julianne Moore, Ryan Gosling, Emma Stone, Kevin Bacon, and Marissa Tomei. It follows the story of a deeply tormented man at the beginning of a divorce. He ends up soul-searching and rediscovering why he was first attracted to his wife when they met. 
Meanwhile, his very handsome mentor, Ryan, an easy womanizer, falls passionately in love with a charming young woman. Are you Steve Jobs? What? Hold on a second. Are you the billionaire owner of Apple computers? No. Oh, okay. Well, in that case, you got no right to wear New Balance sneakers ever. Come on. Number five. The Favorite, 2018. Cannot have hot chocolate. Your stomach, the sugar inflames it. Abigail, hand me that cup. Do not. I'm sorry, I do not know what to do. The Favorite is a 2018 period black comedy film that was directed by Yorgos Lanthimos and stars Olivia Colman, Emma Stone, and Rachel Weisz. In the early 18th century, a frail Queen Anne occupies the throne of England, and her close friend, Lady Sarah, rules the land in her stead while she takes care of Anne's ill health and mercurial temperament. When the new servant Abigail arrives, her charm endears her to Sarah. Abigail sees a chance to return to her aristocratic roots when Sarah takes Abigail under her wing. Abigail. If you forget to load the pellet, the gun fires, makes a sound, but releases no shot. It is a great jape, do you agree? Yes. Number four. Zombieland, 2009. Not as fun as I remember. <sighs> the timid and introvert Columbus is forced to join an experienced zombie killer named Tallahassee to survive the zombie apocalypse. Zombieland is an American post-apocalyptic zombie comedy film directed in 2009 by Ruben Flesher and stars Jesse Eisenberg, Woody Harrelson, Emma Stone, and Abigail Breslin in lead roles. As Tallahassee plans to find the last Twinkie on Earth, the duo will meet Wichita and Little Rock, two girls who have used some unusual technique during the chaos. What do you think? Zombie kill of the week? Number 3. Birdman, or The Unexpected Virtue of Ignorance, 2014. You're great. Oh, thank you. Your ass is great. Dude, seriously? Birdman is a 2014 black comedy drama film directed by Alejandro G. Inuritu and stars Michael Keaton, Zach Galifianakis, Edward Norton, Andrea Riseborough, Amy Ryan, Emma Stone, and Naomi Watts. A washed-up actor tries to regain his fame on Broadway with a new play, in the process, he has to deal with new actors and rekindle his relationship with his daughter. But above all, he must escape the shadow of the superhero he used to play, Birdman. The film won four Academy Awards, including Best Picture and Best Director for Alejandro G. Inarritu. Who are you? That's Sam, my daughter. Oh, your daughter. Wow, that's amazing. You don't look anything like each other. What do you do? Oh, my She's my sister. Works for me. And does she talk? Uh, and speak. She does. Number two, The Help, 2011. Boys, we'll be right back. Y'all talk about quarterbacks or something. <laughs> You'll make it, Miss Skeeter Coca-Cola. Yes, the Help is a 2011 period drama film written and directed by Tate Taylor and stars Jessica Chastain, Viola Davis, Bryce Dallas Howard, Allison Janney, Octavia Spencer, and Emma Stone. The film recounts the story of young white woman and aspiring journalist Eugenia Skeeter Fellin during the civil rights movement of the 1960s. The story focuses on Skeeter's relationship with two black maids. She decides to write a book from the point of view of the maids, exposing the racism they are faced with as they work for white families. Maybe things can change. What law's gonna say you got to be nice to your maid? You don't have to do this now, Minnie. You damn right I don't. You two give me heart palpitations. Before we unveil movie number one, here are a few honorable mentions. I don't know, we could, I don't know, we could, uh, or we could do something else, or we could, if you don't, I mean, uh, like, we could. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah, either one. Really? Sure. What are you doing here? I know, I gotta get out of town, you should too. I can't. Gracie, look, for whatever it's worth, Look, for whatever it's worth, Cohen had nothing to do with us. Not for one second. Don't run. Just stay. You wanted to see me? Yes. Your, your paper was quite good. Really? Yes. I read so many papers, and usually the students are merely paraphrasing what they've read, but I found your thinking fresh and well presented. Number one, La La Land, 2016. Any other requests? 
Girl in the front. I ran. I ran. La La Land is a 2016 romantic comedy drama musical film written and directed by Damien Chazelle and stars Ryan Gosling and Emma Stone. The film tells the story of the up-and-coming actress Mia and the dedicated jazz musician Sebastian, who struggle to make ends meet while pursuing their dreams in a city known for destroying hopes and breaking hearts. Set against the backdrop of today's Los Angeles, this musical about everyday life explores what's more important, a once-in-a-lifetime love or the spotlight. My lord, did you just say a serious musician? I don't think so. Can I borrow what you're wearing? Why? Because I have an audition next week. I'm playing a serious firefighter. So you're an actress. I thought you looked familiar. Have I seen you in anything? Do you agree with our list? Please let us know in the comments. If you want to know more about a particular movie in this list, you can check out our links in the video description. And for more top 10 movie videos, be sure to subscribe to Community TV.